Well, hello again to all the boys and girls out there in YouTube land watching. George Bear Views back at you today with another one, and I've got a very interesting product. Uh, I saw it at the gas station convenience store the other day, and I had to buy a four-pack. It caught my eye, and I love Bloody Marys, so I think I'm going to like this. This is the Frank's Red Hot Bloody Mary original. It is made by Enoble Beverages. St. Paul, Minnesota. I have had other products from Innoble, Innoble Beverages. Um, the most recent being the TGI Friday's Long Island Iced Tea uh, Malt Beverage. 10% alcohol. I thought it was very well done. So Innoble makes, uh, or contract brews, I guess you could say, products like this for different Places that don't produce their own alcoholic beverages. So 5.5% alcohol. It says flavored malt beverage with natural flavors and artificial colors. A little thing here, a little description on the label. It says now we've put that stuff into our own bar crafted Bloody Mary recipe. Natural ingredients plus Frank's Red Hot Original Cayenne Pepper Sauce with aged cayenne peppers bring a whole lot of flavor and life to this classic cocktail. Enjoy. It does say to turn it upside down and shake gently. All right, let's crack it open, give it a pour, see what we are dealing with here. Looks like a Bloody Mary. Not carbonated. A Bloody Mary appearance. A nice reddish color. It's got that, you can see it leaving the little splotches on the side of the glass from the tomato pulp. The aroma, you're definitely getting the tomatoes. A little bit of like a black pepper thing. Some of the red hot hot sauce is coming through as well. That uh, that that's pretty much it. Uh, it smells like a spicy tomato juice drink, like spicy V8. All right, so smells good. Let's get into it. Cheers, guys. Mmm. Wow. Really nice tomato flavor. You're getting uh, a little bit of heat, you know, right off the bat. Um, I, I want to say black pepper. Obviously, it does have the cayenne and the red hot sauce in there. If you've ever had Frank's Red Hot, you're definitely getting that flavor note. But I feel like I'm getting a little bit of black pepper as well. It's not carbonated. It doesn't really tastes like a michelada it tastes just like if you pour this over ice and garnished with a spicy green bean and a celery stick i mean it's a bloody mary in a can absolutely no alcohol presence whatsoever at 5.5 percent mm, that is smooth 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 stuff really love the can art just pretty simple but you're they're featuring the Frank's Red Hot logo there. It says alcohol already in it. And where is it? On the back there. I put that on everything, which is the Frank's Hot Sauce uh, motto there. Pretty cool stuff. I am very impressed. As a Michelada and a Bloody Mary lover, I think this is beautiful. I think it's done to perfection. You never know what you're going to get with these malt beverages. Sometimes the quality is lacking, but this is excellent. It tastes just like the real deal. It's a Bloody Mary in a can. And it's got a little bit of heat to it as well. I do like my Bloody Marys on the spicy side, so this would be perfect. Um, and $7.99 for a four-pack, it's really not too bad of a deal. I mean, it's not the best deal. I wish it was $7.99 for a six-pack. 
Um, but nonetheless, it's a, a great value, and hopefully it'll start becoming more widespread. If you can find this in your area, let me know. Um, very interesting product lineup from Ennoble Beverages. Like I said, the TGI Fridays and now the Frank's Red Hot. If you go to the Ennoble Beverages website, that's all they list right now. The TGI Fridays lineup, which they have three different ones, the Moscow Mule, a Long Island Tea, and then a Blackberry Long Island Tea. All of which were really good. I've got reviews for the uh, for those coming up soon on my channel. This one is the best Enoble beverage product that I've had so far. Uh, I like the other ones, but they're on the sweet side. I like I like the tanginess, the 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 spiciness, and just the 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 feel of this. Uh, it's got that authentic Bloody Mary feel, and it's excellent. I'm just gonna go with a 95 out of 100. It's a solid A. Um, and it is legitimate Bloody Mary. Uh, it tastes just like the real deal, and I love the fact that they put the red hot uh, hot sauce in it because it gives it a nice kick, and like I said, I like those spicy Bloody Marys. So a winner. If you can fi find it, buy it, try it, let me know what you guys think. That'll do it for this review. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Until next time, everybody, cheers.